guys is Martian log seven days out so it's about six o'clock at night I've already done a lot today so we're gonna go over everything and then kind of just tell you guys what the plan is how things have been going and how today has been so woke up like 231 as I said um, I was like 232 but had some digestive clear after cardio had some water stuff like that so probably around 231 up just slightly from the carb day um, a little bit of inflammation from the legs, but that's about it. I don't think I really put on any weight from the carbs. Really just knocked some water off of me. Got me a little bit harder. Put me in a rev state. Got my metabolism back revved up. Got my hunger back kicked up. And now I'm going to go <clears throat> and go back into fat burning mode. So today we, we walked two miles to Starbucks. Um, did some work. Walked two miles back. That was the cardio i was all bundled up in the vegas heat uh so got burned a ton of calories there um kept food pretty low today i'm only did 200 carbs for the whole day i did 100 pre 100 post um for me i know that that's keeping me in a depletion state it's just enough to have a good training session uh give me some energy right around my workout and then afterwards i'm smashed i'm depleted um and beat up and tired so <clears throat> just showered up here for the rest of the day uh, just have some pro veg meals and a pro fat meal um, we're gonna go walk the strip and really burn some fat off of us so it's just kind of fun um, extra neat cardio so we're gonna do that um, and then like I said tomorrow we'll wake up we'll evaluate again um, and likely go into a hard push for the next couple days uh, tomorrow is Monday it is going to be chest day uh, we'll be pushing hard one couple last hard hard sessions before we go into more of a pump type workout training session where we really pull volume back um, and intensity so right now volume is pulled back a little bit but intensity like i said uh, still keeping those top sets very hard and heavy uh, just pulling intensifiers body feels good time feels good um, this one's mine guys so the martian has landed and i'm so excited we announced everything and i'm just ready to share this journey with you guys so thank you uh, appreciate you liking subscribing and following along and we have more days to come morning guys so we're sitting at a uh, Starbucks this is four shots of espresso getting the day started off right so we uh, bounced from the crib we had a Starbucks that was 0.3 miles away but that's bitch made so there was another one two miles away so I told Zach instead of going to the gym doing cardio on like the stairs or something like that legs are feeling really really fatigued after that training session yesterday we know we did damage so rather than beat them up more a good walk is just good to knock the inflammation off and get digestion going so two a two mile walk that's roughly 25 30 minute walk um perfect walk for us so to get over here we got a nice little sweat going got sat down zach's editing some video I'm gonna get some stuff done on SCED and get some stuff posted up for you guys. Get things ready for the next couple days. Um, we'll get things rolling and then we're back into another full day of eating for you guys. And we're seven days out now. So we're, uh, we're gonna train some back this afternoon. We got some other plans to maybe go shop around. And then Zach's dad is here actually in Vegas. Um, and Zach's dad is one of my favorite people. So I definitely wanna see him go spend some time with him and catch up. We haven't got to see each other for a little while, so that'll be kind of fun. Um, but just another day of relaxing, bodybuilding, and making sure that we come in at my absolute best. So I hope that you guys enjoyed yesterday. Um, I hope that you're liking, subscribing, and following along because we're going to be turning these out every day, guys. So we appreciate you following along, and today's going to be even more fun than yesterday. So tune in, keep watching, let's get it. So right now, I'm just doing my computer work. 
while Zach edits. So going through check-ins here, watching videos of my clients, going through their posing, stuff like that. This is my boy Jackson, he's from Wyoming. So I'll go through all these, I'll give my responses that I need to to the people that are in prep or really close to a show. Um, also today, because it's Saturday, I have lots of all my other athletes check in that aren't in prep and stuff like that. So I'll be handling those off season plans, getting those ready and sent out, as well as, like I said, getting some Instagram posts made, um, some things like that ready and prepared for you guys, as well as trying to get some merchandise rolling so that you guys can have some more Martin the Martian stuff. Um, just trying to crank out as much as we can. If you guys have other ideas for us or you want to see us do something, you let us know in the comments below and we'll try to make it happen for y'all. So I'm gonna get back to work and we'll catch you guys after a bit. All right guys, so we just got back from Starbucks. Two mile walk there, some espresso, client work done, video getting uploaded, video edited, um, some posts made for me and IG. Um, now, strip down, see how I look. Uh, we had a two mile walk back, so good bit of cardio this morning. We're gonna see what I weigh um, and kind of evaluate what we're gonna do for the day. So the plan is to go back into fat burning stage um, as long as weight didn't drop too much, which I don't think it did from everything that happened this morning and where I was looking and how I was feeling. So strip down here, see what's up. Walking in the Vegas heat from uh, Starbucks got me pretty sweaty. You guys already know, always wearing my gasp stuff. So I got this oversized thermal on. This thing will help you sweat up a good bit. So got a good sweat. This thing is actually wet all the way down about midway. Uh, so dried out good here. Put my shoes and the paints off. See what we weigh. Legs look dry, they're a little inflamed, but not too bad. Two thirty two. Right in there. So yesterday morning I was two twenty nine. Um, taking into consideration that when we walked back, we both bought an energy drink. Um, those energy drinks are sixteen fluid ounces. So Taking that into consideration when we got here, I took a small pee. I would say that that's probably eight ounces, four ounces, somewhere in there. Um, so taking that into consideration, I'm probably about 231. That's where I would say my weight is. Um, so not a big increase from yesterday. Filled out slightly. Still just as dry, just as hard. Um, so today, go back into fat burning mode. We already started by kicking the day off with some good bit of cardio. We got a lot going on today. We're gonna run around. We're gonna go find some better Wi-Fi to upload this video completely. Um, we got a little bit of running around to do besides that, and then we're gonna train back this afternoon, finish that off. We have about one to two more hard sessions. Then we really get into the peak week stuff where we start really pulling volume back and just letting my body soak up food, relax, get everything done. So I'm gonna get dressed. We're gonna eat meal one and then we're gonna get after the day. So we'll be back, we'll see you in a minute. All right guys, so we got meal number one here. Got it made up, I got eight ounces of turkey, asparagus again. I have a little bit of barbecue sauce and a little bit of sweet and spicy mustard on here. So this is my protein source, then we have a little bit of added fats 16 grams of nut butter just like breakfast yesterday just not the cream of rice with it so i'm going to eat this down we're going to pack up a couple meals and then zach and i are going to get on the road get some things done for today uh go find some better wi-fi and get you guys a video uploaded so eat this down and we got shit to do so i'm going to get quick and get after it all right boys and girls so i just showered we're about to announce that i'm doing the show so I get to shave this Joe Beard, dirt looking ass beard off my face. So I'm very excited about this. This thing has been kind of itchy and gross and it doesn't look that good to me. Um, so I'm gonna get it shaved off here. Get back to my pretty little baby face that I got cause I actually like looking like a little kid. 
It's uh, one of my advantages of being 24 and open bodybuilding. Not everybody's got a cute little baby face like me. So and get this baby shaved down, get it smooth looking, and then uh, we got the day, rest of the day coming at you. This right here, best razor on the planet for bodybuilders. I shave my whole body with this before the show, then clean up a couple spots that you need to with a real razor. But this thing gets super, super close, and it's way easier than razor and shaving cream. So as you guys can see, it's just as close as a regular razor probably, and uh, it goes pretty quick, so it's way easier than actually shaving too. You can't tell by the way that sounds. That's the only part of my beard that's thick. All right. Because we're jokesters, we're gonna go take a funny picture and mess with you guys a little bit. So we're gonna tell everybody we're doing class A, but y'all know that's a bunch of bullshit because I just stepped on the scale for you. I think uh, my classic weight cap in the pros is uh, 195, so I have to chop my leg off to make it, but it'll be funny. I never had a mustache like this, so we're gonna take a little picture with this handlebar, and then I'll shave everything actually off. All right, boys and girls, so we're running around, like I said. You get the baby face now. Um, we're gonna go to Smith's. I want some rice cakes. I'm back on these low foods, so I'm gonna get some food volume up. Um, I'm gonna get some rice cakes, get a couple other things. The video's almost done rendering, so we figured we'd run around and get that done. And we're gonna head back to the room, eat a pre-workout meal, and we're headed to the Dragon's Lair to smash some back. So, let's go check out the groceries. Hold up, hold up, ab check. Yeah, I think they're there. Rice cereal. This is the best post workout. I'm probably not going to use any for a couple more days. But Zach needs to eat. He's trying to get huge. What are you looking for? Oh, it's that one. Oh. That's how good my brain is working. Ground turkey. We getting some of this. We have a few more meals until Mega Fit gets here, and then I don't have to do any more meal prep. So we'll get these and finish it off for the next couple days. You're kidding me. They have sugar free, full of fat, but they don't have fat free. That makes no sense. Uh, Woohoo! Uh, these ones. These ones. They don't have any chocolate, but this will work for now. Are you excited for rice cakes finally? So, apple cinnamon, caramel. I'm very excited for rice cakes. A little volume here is very nice at the end, especially because I'm just so hungry. So like yesterday, if we would have been able to find rice cakes, I would have done half cream of rice, half rice cakes, and used the rice cakes to eat the cream of rice. Um, as scoopas, as Rob Taylor would call them. So uh, shout out to the Brixley Pitbull. He's competing today over in Italy. That was a, a very good show it looked like. Um, so excited to see the results from that. But right now we're gonna finish up grocery shop and get back to the room.
good how you mean. Do you have quarter block? It is made by Gorilla Chemist. Uh, Kim X. Yeah, I just want to see if we have some on our stock here. The G Since we have two. Awesome. Have you taken that? Uh, no, but my buddy did. Do you like it? Uh, he had a weird reaction. Why not put him somewhere? Yeah, actually. He didn't know that the main ingredient was lax. Yeah. Give me a second to try to find it for you. Yeah, you're fine. Um, I mean, I could just walk around and find it too, bro. I mean, we're gonna. I'll look around and end up spending money, so it's fine. <laughs> Do you guys carry HD muscle? Oh, we gotta, we gotta get them in here. That's who I work for. Who? HD. Oh, I'm uh, not familiar, man. No? No. Oh, it's a, like the biggest company in Canada. Oh. Um, yeah, man. Then but, again, I'm not super plugged into. Yeah. Oh, you're good, man. Oh, perfect. All right, guys. So we're in this nutrition store. Picking up some quarter block, picking up some ravenous, and then for post show treat, I've been craving one bars. So I got a cookies and cream one bar. This is like a candy bar to me. My favorite is the donut one, but I haven't had this one and I want to try it. So a little treat for me. Excited for this one. One bar, sponsor me. 182.84. I'd offer you some samples of what we're out today. Oh, that's perfect. Right. Nigga, huge! Damn! Alright guys, so just like yesterday, same thing. Eight ounces of cod. Now for carbs, um, after looking at my pictures, and you guys can refer to the Martian log of everything that I'm doing for the day as a plan, um, but you guys will see there that I decided to do 200 carbs, um, which is a 300 carb reduction from the day before. Um, and as you guys saw with the leg day and stuff, uh, this morning I was only up, like I said, about a pound, pound and a half, two pounds. And uh, we know that it's, uh, most of that is just inflammation from training and digestion hadn't cleared. So I was probably about the same weight, uh, but I want to go back into a fat burning state. So we're going to put some carbs in for training, 100 pre here, 100 post, um, and go right back into digging this last shit out. Um, we're going to be flat. We're gonna look like garbage probably, not gonna have all the detail pushing out, but that doesn't matter, cause fat kills flat, and, or <laughs> flat kills fat, and uh, that's where we're at at this point. We wanna make sure that we're the most dug out, nasty, peeled motherfucker on stage. That's all that matters, cause if we bring that, I think that we'll win this show. So, cod, hunter carbs. Um, I'm going to be doing 65 grams of cream of rice and then five rice cakes, uh, which will equal about 100 carbs altogether. And uh, I'm going to use the rice cakes as scoopas like Rob Taylor does. So um, shout out to the Brixley Pit Bowl, like I said, and I'm going to get after this meal now. What flavor of cream of rice do I want is the real question. I think I'm going to go with chocolate brownie. The perfect bowl. I already told you guys why you get the perfect bowl and the reasons behind it. But again, 
It just makes cream of rice that much better if you have the right bowl to cook it in. Got 65 grams of cream of rice there, which is about 50 carbs from this. And I'll do four times the water. We're right in the, around there. This coffee pot's the best way to pour water without making a mess. Where are we going after we eat this? So we are going to go to the Dragon's Lair. And train? We got back today. Big back day. One of our last real heavy sessions um, that I get to actually get some muscle breakdown before Zach will be yelling at me to be smarter and train smarter um, after that. So, back today, like I said, we'll uh, have a good session, 100 carbs here. Hopefully that fuels me up enough to be able to smash things. And then right back into depletion mode, right back into burning fat. All right, boys and girls, back home, ready for a post-workout meal here. So I got eight ounces of turkey, a little barbecue sauce, I got 65 grams of cream of rice here with five rice cakes. I have Vita HD, Liver HD, Kidney HD, Corda Block, a vitamin C pill, and some Tudka in here. I have this water, some salt, um, and then last but not least, just got to show you guys. So I was talking about Rob Taylor using these as scoopas. We found a better way. I like it better if you take it scoop it and spread it on the rice cake this is the perfect way to do it um i'm not going to eat this right away though because if you know me you already know i eat carbs after the protein especially when i'm depleting so we'll wait on the carbs i'm gonna eat this protein first all right guys so we had our post-workout meal we got showered up now we're gonna go do some cardio um more like neat or really just fucking off and having fun, but burning calories at the same time, digging into these fat stores. Um, Zach and I are gonna go down to the strip and walk around. Zach's never really been down there and he hasn't been down there since he's 21. So at least he can walk on the floor. We might hit a couple slot machines, um, but really just go have some fun, go let loose, kind of get our mind off of bodybuilding, the stress of all of this, and just have some fun and enjoy Vegas while we're here. So, um, you know, the coolest thing about this right here is the dynamic that I have with Zach and the support that I have from him. Um, we've just been doing this and it's really just me and my best pal kicking ass and taking names and running all over the country having a lot of fun. So tonight, same thing. Bro time. We're just going to go fuck off. Hopefully Zach's dad, he's actually in Vegas for some meetings and uh, hopefully we can link up with him down on the strip. BS. Um, he's a hoot and a blast. And there's nobody that's got better dad humor than Zach's dad. So I love hanging out with him. I'm excited to go see these guys. And then we'll just go have a good time, guys. Um, this is what this is all about, enjoying the process and uh, loving bodybuilding. You guys know me. Um, I love this more than anything in the whole world. So let's go have some fun. Quick question. Are you taking meals with you? And if so, how are you doing it? All right, guys. So definitely taking meals with me. Um, I have some pro veg meals. I got the anabolic fanny pack here. Um, inside my fanny pack, I have a spork. I have some protein powder in case. That's a, this is a just in case meal. Um, but I actually have 99 turkey, eight ounces here with asparagus and a little bit of sweet chai chili sauce. Jeez, I can't talk. Um, in the plastic bag, that goes in the fanny pack. Even have my digestive enzymes and my nightly pills uh, for bed in here. So as we're walking around, I can stay on top of everything, stay on track. Um, nothing is missed, nothing is forgotten about. Um, this is all for a purpose and we're still here to win the show. So even though we're going to have some fun and dinking off, everything is prepared and set up. Um, if you're not prepared, you're prepared to fail. So we're going to the strip. All right, so we're walking around, eating our meal. Met up with Zach's dad. Get that extra cardio in. All right, guys. So we got back from the strip. Meal five. I got eight ounces of fish, cod here, more asparagus, a little bit of Thai chili sauce. I get one rice cake, which is 10 carbs, 
and 32 grams of nut butter. Um, this is going to help me go to bed here. I'm going to try to sleep as much as I can. When I wake up to pee in the middle of the night, I'll do a shake of Pro HD. Today will be my last day with using protein powder. Um, so I'll do that. And then off to the races tomorrow. So there's another day in the books for you guys. Appreciate your support. Um, we'll get up in the morning. We'll hit the Martian log. We'll give you guys the rough and dirty of what we're doing and how things are going. Get checked in and keep you following along for the rest of the days so like and subscribe guys please turn on your notifications share this everything like that i really really want everyone to follow along and be part of this prep with me finish things strong so appreciate your support guys and uh we'll see you tomorrow